With the new release of Laravel 5.7, we have various new features and the great new feature is must verify email. So in this episode, we are going to see how we can implement this and actually on Laravel end, how this email verification is going to work. So let's dive into that and already I have installed Laravel 5.7 and you can see here if I say PHP artisan hyphen hyphen version it will give you level 5.7.0 or you can check on conf, uh, composer.json file which is level framework 5.7 that's good and if you try to download the new version of Laravel right now maybe it will not give you Laravel 5.7 so what you need to do you need to say Laravel new and your project name and then hyphen hyphen dev this will give you the latest version that is 5.7 but if you are watching this video later you don't have to do anything so how this email verification is going to work so let's just say php adsense migrate fresh and it just uh, install every table or migrate every table and I have already connected to the database which is my test database where's that mm, yeah here it is test database and you can see on this test database if I refresh now on the user table we have a new column which is called email verified at you can also see that on the migration table here we have you can see the new uh, column which is email verified at which is actually nullable for now this means it's not compulsory to use this feature and that's great thing for this level i have already run the php artisan make auth command so that we also have this login and registration uh, button so let's click on register and try to register so we have these things and we are easily registered because we have not implemented our uh, must email verification new feature so let's just again migrate fresh so that the database is empty out nothing is there and now let's implement these things let's go to the documentation once more and here on this documentation you can see email verification is there and you can just go to this actual documentation it's just uh, uh, information about the new feature and the real documentation is here email verification and what you need to do you need to migrate which we have already migrated then we need to use this route so let's go here and because we already ran the php artisan make auth we get uh, this route which is just for login registration but now we need to use this route which is just having an optional thing which is verified true so this is done next step is we need to use this uh, verified middleware which just going to protect any route we want to protect for uh, before the email verification then we will do this later so we have some view which is on the resources views auth and now we have the verify dot plate we will see this what it is but now what we ne actually need to do we actually need to use a new interface on our user model so to implement that thing we just have to say implements and the new interface name is must verify email okay so this is the new interface we need to implement here don't forget to include this at the top so that you have the actual uh, real path here so that's it we have implemented this thing just two step one is the route and other is this interface implementation and now we can easily go to our Laravel app click on this register and because this is going to uh, implement the email verification that means it's sending the email and to send email we need to configure our application to send the email and which I have already done we have this mail trap information here so that we can get the mail on our mail trap so let's open mail trap and here let's fill these things so that we can have the verified email and it says already taken okay i think i have done something here so let's again php adson migrate fresh that's great and now once more let's try oops and 
and now hit register and it's taking time this means it's sending the email and on our mail trap we must have a new email you can see verify email uh, address and this is the interface you will get on your uh, email so here you can see it's logged in but now we need to protect any route against the email verification user can see the home page but how we can protect so let's go to the web.php file and what i'm going to do i'm going to create a new route so let's say i'm going to create a route and route name is profile okay and for now just giving a closer which is just going to return this is profile this is pretty easy things and now if i try to go to profile it will give you this is profile but we can use middleware of verified and this will protect you from uh, any unauthorized action against the email verification so if i refresh you can see it's now redirecting me to this page which says that before proceeding check your email for a verification link which is here okay so let's click on this verify email and boom we are here this means now if i try to go to the profile page we can see that and obviously here we have but if as I refresh, I go to home page and same thing here for the profile. You can see that and it's super easy. Just two step. One is implementing this route, which is just adding this uh, option. And second is implementing this uh, interface. So this is all about how you can use the email verification. And in the next episode, we will go deep dive into that and see how this email verification is going to work, what this interface is going to do, how this is going to redirect and all these things deep dive into the email verification new feature. So if you have liked this episode and if you want to see how Laravel implemented these features in the Laravel 5.7, Check out the next video and don't forget to like Bitfumes on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. If you have not subscribed, go and subscribe to this channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon to get instant notification. We will meet in the next episode. Till then, goodbye.